You know, it'll be harder, right? At eight years old, Carla Vatka seems like any typical girl, eager to get out and play and list off the names of her favorite toys. My daddy likes this one because it's an owl and his name is Chubby. But five months ago, Carla almost died. The principal, Miss Patty Spore, she was crying and she said, um, the ambulance is leaving, but Carla doesn't have a heartbeat. Carla collapsed from sudden cardiac arrest while on the playground at Antelope Elementary School. She was gone for 20, at least 25 minutes. After two teachers performed CPR, a defibrillator was used to shock Carla's heart. Carla, although she didn't know it, had an underlying condition, has an underlying condition called long QT syndrome. And that is an electrical problem with the heart that puts kids and adults, for that matter, who have it at risk for sudden cardiac arrest. Carla's parents say there is no question the fast action of those teachers saved their daughter's life and are now pushing not only for greater awareness, but mandatory CPR training at all California schools. If possible, you know, have defibrillators in all schools. We are living here. Uh, I, I always see California as being the most advanced state in the U.S., and we don't have it. While Carla now has an implantable cardioverter defibrillator in place, her prognosis and future is bright. At this point in time, her prognosis is excellent because she, she's on medications and she has an ICD, so she's going to do very well.